If you're looking at our compact keyboards such as the Magma Mini and the Vulcan 2 Mini, you may be wondering what the key differences between the two are and which one you should buy. So today we're going to help you make that decision by giving you more details about the two and comparing what the differences between them are. Here's the Magma Mini versus the Vulcan 2 Mini. The keyboards have some obvious similarities such as both of them coming in a compact size, both of them having easy shift technology, featuring RGB and our IMO illumination, but these are two very different keyboards. Whilst both keyboards are compact in size, the Vulcan 2 Mini is actually a 65% keyboard, whereas the Magma Mini is a 60% keyboard. Notice the Vulcan 2 Mini has a few more dedicated buttons, such as the arrow keys. So if you're really trying to minimize the space on your desk, the Magma Mini is definitely the way to go. But if some of these buttons are too important to have as secondary functions, the Vulcan 2 Mini is the one you should get. One of the big differences starts off with the fact that the Magma Mini is a membrane keyboard, offering a quiet experience, whereas the Vulcan 2 Mini is an optical keyboard offering a much more tactile experience and responsive feedback. The Vulcan 2 Mini has smart keys, which has allowed the keyboard to shrink in size but not in functionality. A lot of the dedicated keys that have been removed are now sat on existing buttons as secondary functions, including many new ones that allow you to monitor your PC, headphones and mouse battery status. While some functions are retained in the Magma Mini, they are far less than the Vulcan 2 Mini. If you want to keep some of the core functions of your keyboard, the Vulcan 2 Mini is the best option. Visually, you'll notice a big difference in the way the RGB is presented. The Magma Mini is illuminated by five zones and can be seen through a translucent plate. The Vulcan 2 Mini not only has double the refresh rate of a standard keyboard, it is illuminated by individual LEDs for each key that's present. If you like to organize your cables and clear unsightly ones off your desk, the Magma Mini might be for you, as the cable is mounted on the left side of the keyboard. With the Vulcan 2 Mini, the cable is mounted in the center. However, it is a detachable USB-C cable, meaning you can customize it. Everyone loves to add their own flair to their keyboard, and custom keycaps are great for doing so. The Vulcan 2 Mini is the only keyboard out of the two that is compatible with third-party keycaps. So if you're not a fan of the default keycaps or you just want something with a bit more flair, you have the option to do so. If you're someone who's clumsy, let's say you spill a lot of drinks frequently, the Magma Mini is spill and dust resistant. Whilst the Vulcan 2 Mini may seem like a good option, you may find you're better off going with the Magma Mini if you're prone to accidents. One of the biggest factors that may influence your choice is the price. The Vulcan 2 Mini costs $149.99, compared to the Magma Mini, which is $100 cheaper. If you're on a budget, the Magma Mini is an obvious one, but if you have cash to spare, the Vulcan 2 Mini offers so much more. So if you're looking for something that's full of functionality, top quality, and cost isn't an issue, the Vulcan 2 Mini is the choice for you. However, if you want something that's cost effective, features great lighting, and is robust, the Magma Mini is the keyboard for you. If you'd like to purchase one of these keyboards or just find out more about them, head over to our website, rockat.com.